Do your past secrets haunt you? Do you wish to tell them, but something holds you back? Come back, kid. You have a job to do. No! Stop! Get away from me! Stop running! <laughs> Is it over? I'm back? <gasps> Agent Kidman? What's going on? Where is this place? I'm afraid I cannot answer that. Are you kidding me? Ugh, oh, waste of time. Hey! I know you're out there! Why this world is the way it is. Hate. Hate. Ruvik's hate. The man's consumed by it. He wants out! Wants to get his revenge! He wants back what he feels the world took from him. Who's that? How does he know about Ruvik? Leslie! If I'm still here, then he must be too. Too bad they dragged you into this. But either way, you're mine. To do with as I please. Sebastian. He must be somewhere else right now. Damn it, he doesn't have anything to do with this. <laughs> Society is wounded. People are suffering, hopeless, just as you were before we saved you. Mobius can now do the same for everyone. STEM is a machine designed to connect everyone's subconscious, and whoever is at the center has the power to influence them. There couldn't be a better tool to change the world, to lead, Society needs a curator, and Mobius will be just that, ushering in the next step of humanity. We must have that boy. He will enable us to change everything. I'll come back with him. I needn't remind you the consequences for failure. But if Ruvik leaves with him, there must be some way to stop him. Mobius. Something is pulling me back there. You should find this useful. While it is theoretically possible for a host to overwrite themselves on a user, the odds of compatibility are astronomical. But the boy, Leslie, you're saying he's a compatible subject. Yes, and based on Ruben's notes, the stem should be able to run with Leslie as its source. 
I need you to do tests. Determine what must be done to make him the blank slate we need. They knew. They knew what Leslie was capable of. Damn it, why would they hide that from me? We had a STEM terminal here, on the lowest floor. If Leslie's in here with me, he's probably headed there. And that may be my way out of here. see anything in here. Chemical lights. Better than nothing, I guess. be a way to get the power back on.
Systems were previously shut down incorrectly. Each terminal requires manual restoration. Please be patient. This isn't the time to make me wait. of ethics on our part. He seemed motivated, obsessed with revenge against something never specified. We discovered what he was doing in secret. Torturing. Pension for traps. A serial killer masquerading around as a scientist. far too aggressive and his techniques even more perverse. Da Vinci would dissect corpses to further his anatomical studies, but what Reuben has done goes beyond demanding his subjects be aware as he dissects them to truly see how the mind reacts. He's more of a butcher than an artist. But we must remain scientists above all. I had taught him from a young age that the end shall justify the means, but I could not have predicted things to be this extreme. Mobius has learned of his involvement due to my carelessness. I've asked they bring him on board to assist in development. Perhaps offering him better facilities and support will refocus him and stave off his gruesome proclivities. This machine was designed for me. People like you, you took my life away, turned me into an abomination. Finally, with this machine, I can go back. I can live the life I was supposed to have. We are forgiving. We are willing to overlook your certain peculiarities for what you can provide us. But you are testing our limits, our manpower, our resources are not here for your pathetic fantasy. You will reverse the calibration on the machine so we can use it without you. And what if I say no? You think he menace can fix this? <laughs> you need me, and there's no way around it. Ruvik. No. Reuben. This was where he was doing his research with us. We were just using him. And I doubt he's the first.
back. Please enjoy this music while waiting. You've got to be kidding me. I'm all right for now. What the? out of this Jimenez. He brought this upon himself. We gave him a chance. Where is he? If you really wish to know, he's in the next room. Come, see. This is despicable. What is this monstrosity? 
despicable? Coming from the man using his own patience to further his own research? The irony of this situation is amusing. But even you must realize what we can do with this. This means... STEM will run. We can continue the experiments. And your assistance is even more necessary than before. This whole project, from the beginning it was about deceit. Ignoring your mission. Running from responsibility. Just like you always do. No, that's not true! You don't know me! That much is obvious. But we need to make sure you do what you're told. You're lying to me. Hiding things. I can't trust you! Not like this! You are not required to trust us. <laughs> 